Smokers and former smokers will tell you trying to put down that pack of cigarettes is a hard habit to break. Yeah, it is, but a new report shows electronic cigarettes could make for an easier transition to giving up smokes for good. KHK's Alexa Vogue has more. Come a long way, baby. Cigarettes were glamorized and advertised for decades, but as more studies came out proving just how dangerous cigarettes are for your health, the tiny sticks disappeared from magazines, billboards, and TV ads. And now there's a new blue glimmer in the spotlight. The electronic cigarette is taking America by storm, with skyrocketing sales and a stampede of new customers ready to switch to the healthier option. Over the past four years, the increase in sales has just been phenomenal. Even doctors back up the vaporized e-cig. It appears to be safer and be a useful tool as far as to stop smoking. There have been other alternatives, like the gum or the patches, but nothing seems to replace the feeling of inhaling that cigarette. Maybe there's something to be said for having something in your hand, something that kind of mimics that smoking, uh, smoking process. A new study says that 13% of people using that e-cig were not smoking regular cigarettes at all a year later. And they found that those, uh, pr those participants who were on the 5 and 7 milligrams did stop smoking. And surprisingly, even some that had no nicotine in it, they stopped smoking as well. Lauren Bailey works at Dragon's Breath Smoke Shop in Tyler and says she quit smoking completely from using the e-cigs. The way I quit, I switched over to um, the refillable electronic cigarettes. The electronic cigarette gives you the nicotine you're craving without the harmful additive. The badness of cigarettes really isn't the nicotine, that's the addictive property. The bad part is really what comes with it, such as the tar and the other contaminants, and those are where the carcinogens are linked to. So the next time you're craving that head buzz, switching to vapor may just be your best bet. Alexa Vogue, KETK News.